Subscribe, motherfucker. In a bunker. <laughs> Yo! <laughs> Oh shit! <laughs> Exploring bunkers. So no, oh, it's an alien. That's one. Now right turn. <laughs> Holy fucking door. A couple of spiders up there. Holy shit. <laughs> <laughs> That's nice. Look at a mushroom.
is us again. We're on the road again after uh, couch surfing for the last two nights. Um, we're about to hop off the ferry. Uh, this was a really nice ride. As you would have seen in the video before this, we had a nice guy, a lovely guy playing guitar for us in the morning. Yeah, off we go. Another day, another adventure. It's raining again. I couldn't see. Oh, there's a car right there to our right. So uh, we made it to our camp spot for the day and night. It's raining, cats and dogs, cats and dogs but it uh, looks like it'd be really nice on a nice sunny day. It's really, it's really cool. Yeah, we're just having a, having a wander around, checking it out. Hi guys. Here we are, we're at Deception Pass Recreational Area Campground. Jim's just cooking us a sweet feed. All our random stuff. So, this shelter was built during the Great Depression by the Civilian Conservation Corps, which was an organisation put together where they took young men who were unemployed, who had family on welfare, and they put them to use working on the national parks, the provincial parks, and other recreational areas. Building shelters, they were also building roads, and just random stuff like this little building down here. They built that too. And all the unemployed wood, wood men and like the wood makers and the stone masons and all that, they came and they trained the boys and showed them what to do. So this building here was made completely using materials off site, like they took those rocks, they chopped them down, they felled the trees, they prepared the wood, everything. The building's been restored to its original state, but during the time they made everything themselves using materials on site. And yeah, this is pretty awesome today that it's not raining it's quite windy though but yesterday it just rained all day did go for a hike and realized today that the place i was hiking by myself was called cougar pass so i'm glad i didn't bum into a cougar without having jim to protect me this statue here is dedicated to the civilian conservation workers and all the work they did for the washington state parks which is now still here for everyone to enjoy these guys were only getting paid one dollar per day. Gang, gang.